Right. Now here, there are some questions. Okay, I'm going to ask these questions and you are going to answer them. Look at the first question. Do you squeeze the toothpaste tube or roll it? What is the advantage of your method? Hmm? Uh, I usually roll it because, because uh, the advantage is uh, then we can roll the empty, empty uh, side of the toothpaste uh, tube. Uh -huh. Then we can uh, then then we can then we know how much uh, available in this toothpaste tube. Uh -huh. You know exactly how much is available. Yes. Uh huh. And uh, also you can use uh, all the paste. Yes. All the paste. Otherwise, if you just squeeze it, what will happen? Some toothpaste would be left in the container. Yes. Mm -hmm. It can't be uh, it taken can, out. It can't get out. Yes, take out. Uh, so it's a it's a bad. Uh, it's not a good method. It, it's a disadvantage. Yes. It's not a good method. Yes. Sir. Okay. What kind of toothpaste do you use? Um, what is your favorite toothpaste? Uh, I usually use Signal. Uh -huh. Sometimes I uh, use Clover and those things. Uh, yeah, those, yes. What do you consider when you buy a toothpaste? Toothpaste tube. Uh, what do you consider? Do you consider the brand or the price or what? No, I, I consider the price. Uh -huh. <laughs> Uh, but sometimes uh, when dentists uh, re uh, recommend some toothpaste for medicinal purpose, uh, then you I, will go for that. Yes, I buy that. All right. And what kind of toothbrushes do you use? Uh, I usually use uh, signal toothbrushes. Why is that? Uh, I don't know. Uh, many times, uh, my parents uh, buy that uh, signal toothbrushes. I don't know why is that. Mm -hmm. All right. I think what is special for you? Colors or the handle or the bristle of the brush? No, I mean not interested about it. About it. Yes. So if your grandmother has a pink toothbrush, sometimes you might uh, by mistake use her brush or she yes. might use a brush. Yes. It doesn't matter. You yes. Don't care. Hmm? yes. Yes. You don't care. So early in the morning, you go to the bathroom. Your <laughs> grandmother is using your toothbrush. How do you feel? Uh, I feel some uncomfortable, but... Uh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Yes. When she finishes, you take the brush and brush your teeth. Isn't that? Yes. I clean it and I brush it. <laughs> right. But if you, in case your grandmother does not have teeth in her mouth and she uses your toothbrush to wash her denture with soap and all, you know, she apply soap to her denture and take the denture to hand and then apply soap and then brush the denture with a toothbrush with soap. Then I don't use it again. You never use it again. Yes. Why is not? Why, why, why won't you use that again? Uh, because it tastes soap. Yes. That? Yes. Oh, you, you, you uh, disgust. Uh, is it disgusting to see her using yes. your toothbrush? Yes. On a danger. Yes. Uh huh. All right. If you were to pick up a select a toothbrush, do don't you consider about the bezel, the quality of the bezel, uh, or the handle and the bezel both, or only handle, only the bezel or the color? What? Only only handle. I I consider about on the handle. Handle should be very strong or what? Yes. Curved. Do uh, you, you, yes, you need a curved be. handle? 
Yes, curved handle and a very strong handle. Uh, Why do you need a curved handle? I think it, uh, then we can brush the corner teeth uh, of mouth easily. Uh, curved one can reach the far end of your mouth. Yes. Uh, uh, all right, good. That's about your toothpaste and toothbrush. Brush, yes. How many siblings do you have? What's your birth order? Uh, I have two siblings. Hmm? Uh, I am the second born in my family. And I have an elder brother. He is the first born in my uh, family. I have a sister also. She is the third born in my family. That means you are the middle born in your family? Yes. You are the middle born in your family. My sister is the last born. The last the born, first yes. born. Yes. So, are you happy about your birth order? Uh, yes, sir. You wish to be the uh, the eldest in the family? No. No, sir. Mm -hmm. I think this is the, uh, there is no any advantage of being an elder, being the elder or the being the last. You don't have any yes. advantage. Yes. No advantages. No advantages. This birth order is your your birth order. Your present birth order is just good. Yes. That. Hmm? Yes. That's the good. Uh, it's the greatest. Uh, yes. What's something you won and how did you win it? Uh, finally, I won all level exam. Mm -hmm. You achieved uh, best results? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, and I got that result from very short uh, period hard working. Uh, so, uh, so I think that's the uh, that's that the thing I want. That's what you have won. Yes. All right. Are you happy? Yes. I happy about my results. Happy, happy about the results or happy about the way that you want it? Uh, I happy about the both things. Oh. <laughs> Uh, because I, I, uh, I, does, uh, I was not care about the exam before about three or months from exam. You didn't have but any I, any. You didn't have any good idea about the exam. Yes. Uh, till it's reached, uh, it, it it was just uh, three months before. Three months. Yes. Uh -huh. So I did. Uh, I. Did all the things in about uh, three months or two months like that, but I, but I got a good result. You got good results. Yes. So you think uh, you think O level exam is not a not a deal, not a big yes. deal. It's yes. not a big but deal. I, yes, but I uh, try to do that in A level exam also. <laughs> you tried uh, the A level also in the same manner. Yes. And you did your lesson. Yes. I learned a lesson from that case. And did your father, father and mother ask you to be more careful about your A level exam? Yes, they told me anything about A level exam before, but I didn't care about them. Mm -hmm. your, father, your father was a man of education, so he didn't advise you much? Yes, he gave me many advices, but I, uh, I was sure about my uh, my your capability capability yes mm -hmm. so it's i even best result within short period of time yes that but, that's what you thought that you had yes but you but didn't I have it really. you didn't have that really yes mm -hmm. oh good all right we move to the question number four What's one of your nicknames? What do you prefer to be called? Uh, so, uh, some of my friends uh, call me as Havo. Mm -hmm. And I don't uh, tell them not to tell you because some, some of my other friends have uh, very uncomfortable names, but it's okay 
because they they, uh, they call it they call me in public also by that name it's not a big thing you don't care yes. much yes it was bearable yes some names are very uncomfortable and uh, so you are happy you have this yes all right what do you think about generally generally about nicknames uh nicknames are easy to use mm-hmm. uh, it also uh, uh, good for a relationship do it is sometimes nickname have something have some meaning yes i mean uh, it's a real meaning yes there are very uh, there are many real meanings i mean uh, do you think uh, the nickname goes together in hand in hand with the character yes written the yes. system they gave you is very much suitable for you yes mm-hmm. all right next one what something your parents used to say say to you as a child that you promised yourself you'd never say but now you catch yourself saying all the time i can't understand the question sir okay your father or mother tell something to you yes that you didn't like and you told yourself well when i grow up i never use that i never say that maybe for an example your mother might say oh i don't have money i don't have money i don't have money every time he says i don't have money even though he has money yes so now you think i shouldn't tell such things but money. now you catch yourself telling the same thing you are also telling the same thing now you that you are grown up yes uh, what is that i was in small uh, about uh, grade before grade 10 my parents said me in your uh, early 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 grades in your school yes. early grade yes uh, uh, that time my parents uh, told me uh, not to be very socialized uh, but it's wrong i don't tell my second generation to not socialize not to be not to be social oh yes Uh-huh. that means don't move with other friends don't have more friends like that yes like that your friend uh, parents ask you to be just uh, sit in a corner and uh, take care of your work don't yes. uh, have many friends like that yes you think it's wrong it's wrong yes why did your father ever ask you to do such things uh i think uh, sometimes from uh, bad friends uh children do some bad words you might have thought that you get spoiled yes and is your father a recluse recluse means a person who lives alone no friends like that yes your father has no friends father has many friends uh, but those days i uh, i was with many kinds of friends and i have i had many friends uh-huh. some of them are not good and that's the reason i think they told me that uh-huh. okay what something you intended to do today but you di- didn't you couldn't do that why not uh you had planned something to do but you could not complete yes what was uh, that i i scheduled to go gym but i couldn't go there uh, because of the fuel queues mm-hmm. uh so that's it yes okay you were standing in a queue today yes. Even today, 
Yes. Every day you stand in queues. No, last week uh, I uh, I got a half tank, okay. but today I got full tank. Oh. Uh, they issue full tank. Yes. Today was no problem. Yes. Today less queue. Uh, yes, less, less queues. Yes. Oh, why today there is petrol enough petrol? Yes, I enough petrol and many people got enough petrol. I think. Uh -huh. Today no problem so petrol. Yes. Do you think this problem will be solved? Yes, I think this will be solved. Uh, after I think sometimes this can uh, go about six or seven months like that. Sometimes uh, it will be okay about after about two months. Not immediately. Yes. Not immediately. It's not immediate. Yes. It's not solving Im immediately. There is no solution in the sign. Yes. Why do you All say that? How can you say government that? cases? Hmm? Government is the main reason. Government is, is earning money in all yes. ways. Yes. Is that? Yes. All right. Let's go to the other question. Using only one word for person, what was your first impression for of each person present with you now? Maybe you can talk about your parents or family members. Yes. Using one yeah. word. Okay. Um, you can say my mother. You can use, say, you can yes. say kind or kindness. My mother, you can describe her with the word kind or love. Uh, my mother, uh, I think, uh, very encourage, encouraging. Person. Yes, uh, and my father also encourage mm. and helping. And your father's helping. Yes. Uh, and my sister very uh, lovely and loving. My brother, yes, loving. And my brother. Uh, how can I say that people with uh, people who engage with uh, studies very much? Studious. Yes, my brother. Yeah. Studious. Studious. Yes. Studious. Mm -hmm. And I have some friends. Uh, uh, they also have many good uh, qualities. Good qualities. Uh, so that's it. All right. What is something that people do in traffic that really bothers you? Uh, um, I think begging is the. They give? Yes, begging, begging. Uh, go begging. Why don't you like beggars? Uh, they do. They they do very. Uh, bad thing to so, uh, social. Why? Society. What society. bad things do they do to the society? They encourage many people to earn money uh, without... Uh, they encourage people for easy money? Easy money, yes. yes. That's the main reason. And they bother people uh, very much. Yes. Then uh, only that. Yes. What about other drivers swearing? Swearing is telling bad things. Oh, yes. You don't like that? Yeah, or you like it? Yes. Some drivers also uh, driving really angry. Uh, angry. It also uh, you know. bad bad uh, bad thing no, you don't like that yes i don't like that mm, yes okay who is the closest friend you ever had describe that relationship 
Uh, I have friend Johnny. Uh, he's the closest friend because uh, he helped me to everything. Uh, and I also help him for his every any work. And yes. That's the uh, yes. Okay, very good. And uh, the next one, what books on your shelf are begging to be read? Uh, begging to be read means uh, you can't help reading. You feel you are like attracted to th these books. Very attracted. Yes. What uh, it's Harry Potter books. Uh -huh. Whenever you see that, you feel like reading it? Yes. It's I have read them uh, before three or four times. Uh -huh. But it it still, uh, tells me to read again and read again. Uh, that means it's, it's still begging to be read. Yes. Begging to be read. Yes. What room in your house best reflects your personality? Explain why. So I can't understand it. Now, when you say reflect reflection, you understand reflection? Is it uh, if you, Kannari? Yes, if you yeah, if you hold a mirror to a to the sun sunlight, then you can reflect the light to somebody else's face with the mirror. Yes, you can turn the direction. Yes. Okay, that is reflecting. And uh, what room in your house best reflects your personality? Now, for an example, if you go to one room, maybe if you go to the kitchen. People understand your mother's personality, right? Everywhere oh, yeah. they ask garbage and everywhere they ask water, and people might think, oh, good, this woman is very dirty, like that. You understand? Yes. yes. I so, think uh, my bedroom is. The, your bedroom the, shows your personality? Yes. It's very tidy. Uh, I mean, Picas uh, is very uh, clean and. Uh, yes, it's very clean. But sometimes it's uh, not very tidy. Tidy, yes. It's not very tidy sometimes. It's untidy. It's an untidy bit. But it shows your, it reflects your personality. Yes. Mm -hmm. What kind of a person you are. So if anybody comes to your bedroom, can understand what, can think, can have, can estimate your personality. Is that? Yes. Yes, sir. Next question is, how often do you doodle? And what do you doodle do usually look like? Doodle means? Doodle means you draw something aimlessly. You don't know what you're drawing yourself. You understand? When you I... take a pen and you just draw lines and you, you are not sure you are what you're going to draw, you have no idea, right? Yes. Go on drawing. You understand? Yes. Sometimes, do you do that? Yes, sometimes I do that. Uh, sometimes I do that when I uh, hear some classes, uh -huh. but I don't know why I am, I am doing that. Okay. I, okay. Go on. Uh, I write some boxes and I, uh, I draw more boxes inside the that box and yes that's the doodle that i write okay what do your doodles usually look like do they look like human humans or do they look no, like they look like just boxes oh, many boxes. kinds of boxes in uh, in another box and yes okay all right question number 30 what do you do if you can't sleep at night? Do you count sheep, toes and turn, or get up and try to do something productive? You can't mm -hmm. sleep one day, you can't sleep at night. And then what do you do? You count sheep. You understand sheep count, counting sheep, sheep. No, sir. Sheep means? Sheep means uh, small animals. Uh -huh. Like goats. Yes. In uh, different countries, they have, they take mutton from goats here, right? Yes. Different countries, they take uh, mutton from sheep. Ah, yes. 
you know that animal we use yes. uh, its wool also we cut yes. wool hmm? yes you know that uh, animal yes sir and counting uh, sheep means you sleep and you in the mind you see that sheep are running somewhere and then you start counting and then white sheep jump and then you start counting and when you keep counting sheep in the mind with closed eyes you automatically go to sleep go to bed so that is an english exercise yes right? yes uh, so, i think i am trying to do some productive that means right. uh, Toss and turn means you turn to the one side and the other side and again the other side and you try to sleep. Toss and yes. turn. Yes. Again, fairly fairly no again a toss and turn and they fairly fairly no you toss toss and turn. Yeah. Oh, get up and try to do something productive. What do you do? I do third one. Uh, try to do something productive. Uh, like uh, creating some animation or uh, like that. Which do you do more often? Hum or whistle? Hum means mm, like that's humming, and you know what whistle. And do you hum or whistle? What I whistle. You whistle. What time yes. do you whistle? Uh, that uh, that whistle means. Especially when there are no, no, when there's nobody, you visit. Yes, I visit. Yes, yes, yes. 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 How, how do you feel when you visit? You feel good, or what? Right. Uh, yes, I feel some uh, free, mm -hmm. freedom. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. You never <laughs> guess that somebody will listen to your whistle, whistling. No, I uh, whistle when. Nobody is around me. Nobody is around, and you are yes. very sure that nobody is listening. Then yes. you whistle. Yes. Somebody is listening. You don't whistle. Yes. Why I don't whistle in public, sir. You don't want to whistle in public. Yes. Why? It's a bad habit. It's a bad and habit. No, you can't whistle. No, I can whistle, uh -huh. but I don't whistle in public. Uh, it's a, it's a bad habit. I think. Okay. Okay. What animal? Are you the most like dog? That means you are like a dog. Yes, I like dog uh, because. But you like dogs. You are like a dog. No, I don't. I not. I'm not like a dog. Uh, yeah, I'm asking. What animal are you the most like? That means you are like a dog. Means uh, you also have the qualities of a dog. Uh, yes, I don't know. Which animal is like me? Uh, Maybe dog is a good animal. If you say I'm like a dog, you can say I know, I remember everything. If people do good to me, I remember that. Right? Uh, yes. Yes. It good. Faithful like that. Yes. You like dogs? Hmm? Yes, I like dogs. Okay. Can you give a reason why you like dogs? Why are you like a dog? Why you think you are like a dog? Do you what what qualities of a dog that you have? Because uh, dogs can remember people. No, 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 no not that. I am asking what animal are you the most like? Why Betty? Me, Mona, why? Sathe kuda saman. If you. Yeah. Aro sathe kuda saman kora. Mona sathe aro the saman. Betty puru. Dog. Yes, dog. Because uh, dogs can remember uh, every person who uh, who help him and who attack him. That's the reason. So you also can do that. Yes. Uh, you remember every ups and downs in your life. Yes. So you are like a dog. Yes. But dogs are taken for its quality, that faithfulness. It love its master. Yes. Right. You have that quality or not? Yes, I have that quality also. Uh -huh. Whom do you love? Um, my parents. Your parents. Yes. Uh -huh. How many days could you last in solitary confinement? How would you do it? 
solitary confinement solitary, solitary confinement means only yourself by yourself no others no friends no parents no sisters no brothers no friends you are in one place oh, yes right solitary confinement hmm? uh -huh. how long how many days can you stay in solitary confinement i uh, i was in Price, you you have been, you had you had been in a solitary confinement. Yes, in my in I was uh, in with Corona uh -huh. fever. Uh, so, but I I get uh, I got every meal and I got every medicine, but I was uh, alone. Uh, it's okay, I think. Mm -hmm. It also I can survive with it. Many days. About two weeks. Yes. Do you save right uh, two weeks? No. So yes. how would you do it? How you are going to find your food? Mm -hmm. uh, all all foods and all, all meals uh, I have provided. Mm -hmm. You have provided, yes. and you are going to provide them in the future also. Yes. Provide yourself with yes. those things. All yes. right. And do you have? Do you save all greeting cards and letters, or throw them all away? Why? I throw them away. Why? They are not. Uh, what you? They are not usable after. After reading uh, the test. After reading the test. Do you love to receive them? Uh, yes, yes. You I love, love to receive them, them. But... Yes, yes, sir. Mm. But I don't uh, uh, stay them with me. You don't like to keep them with you. Yes, keep them with me. Because they take much space in your life, in your fam, in your place. Yes. Mm. So you throw them away. Okay. Yes. Next one, eighty, right? On a scale yes. of one to ten, how well do you sing? On a scale one to ten means that you don't understand. No sir. On a scale of one to ten, a a ka bhi singer nahi kothai. Ikke indela la ikke indela lahai dahai the lakhon dhun nut. Abhi hum toh kya nahi? Ikke indela dahai the lakhon dhun nut kiri kya nahi mai? On a scale of one to ten, on a scale of one to hundred, you understand? Ikke indela singer lakhon dhun nut. How well you do you sing? Why are you singing? 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 I think about two or three marks. Two or three marks. Yes. Because I can't sing well. Uh, yes, that's the reason. Okay. When you're alone at home, do you wear shoes, socks, slippers, or barefoot? Barefoot is nothing. No shoes. How yes, do you I move in the house? Barefoot. You move in the house barefoot. Yes. Uh -huh. At all. You never wear yes. slippers, shoes, no. Yes. Okay. No. Oh, yes. Yeah. No, I don't use. Uh, uh, I don't use any wears. I I go with uh, barefoot. Okay. What are the advantages and disadvantages of being your height? Um, being advantages. Uh, being my height, uh, it can uh, show a best personality, mm. and it can show a uh, best body. Mm -hmm. That I mean, figure mm -hmm. uh, and some of these disadvantages are uh, sometimes uh, when I'm traveling in buses, uh, my head is hitting to the uh, hood of the bus. Mm -hmm. uh, it's an advantage. All right. uh, sometimes, uh, one more advantage we can uh, I can uh, 
average month? How many expire? How many expire before you use them? Now, even when you pay the telephone bill, you get some credit, some star marks, right? Sometimes you never use them. Okay. Yes. Like when uh, you get a discount or savings or coupons, you get. But sometimes you just keep them and uh, you don't know they have expired and you didn't use them. You understand? Yes. That happens to you. Yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, I okay. think three or two times I have uh, I happened that I have happened that uh, with some uh, discount coupons uh, because I forgot them after go there. Yes. Okay. Now that's what happened. Yes. Then who's the biggest pack rat in your, you know? Pack rat. Pack rat. Can you get rid of him in a pack rat? Can you have a kunugram? Make a hover and can you see that with a gram in there? Pity pack a tech card like a pack a tech at the mega take a door again. Make a passion make a tiagan. No, no. Oh, he collects everything. Never tries to throw anything. So there are pack rats at home sometimes. Yes. Who is the biggest pack rat? You know. Um, one person, he was in my uh, auntie's house. He was a uh, uh, laborer. I mean, uh, he was a laborer of rubber uh, that uh, in rubber garden. Uh, he he. Uh, take everything to his uh, room and he uh, collect them all. Mm -hmm. They are not useful, mm -hmm. but he collect uh, many of them. And after he go away, uh, we we put them all of them to garbage mm -hmm. and we fired them. In. Yes. After he left your ho home. Yes. Now he is no more there. Yes. He doesn't call you. Uh, no. I, no. He doesn't why, call us. No. Why did he stop all connection? Uh, I think uh, those days there, there, there are uh, there is a rubber, so rubber rotter rubber garden rubber. Yes, estate. Yes, rubber estate. Uh, he worked in that rubber estate, and. That business was stopped. Business After that, down. yes, it was down now. Yes, closed up. Yes, so he uh, went down. Now, yes. if the if the business opens, he might come again. Uh, yes, sometimes he might come again. Who gives the, him the message? Uh, I think our home and there, there, uh, his number is in our home also. Oh. And we can call him. So you would like to see him again? Yes. I uh, know. I don't like to see him. Why not? Uh, he was very, he was very uh, angry person oh. with everything. He's nervous. He's nervous. Yes. Bad tempered. Getting angry. Yes. Yes. It's bad tempered, hot tempered. You can say he's a hot tempered person. 
bad tempered yes. person. He yes. gets angry for everything. Everything, yes. Uh, so you don't want to see him again. Yes. And that is why you didn't keep any connection with him. Yes. Uh -huh. Because he was so bad and you stopped connections. And yes. It was like that. Yes. Okay, very good. Did you enjoy answering the questions? Yes, sir. How did you feel? Uh, I knew, I know, uh, I Learn. learned new words. Huh? Uh, and I think this is good. What are the new things that you learned? Uh, I think Pakrat is a new word for you. Yes. Pakrat. Uh, there were many, there, because uh, before Saido also, there were some words. Oh. Uh, they, yes. are they are helpful. Yes, they are very helpful. Oh, so there are some words that you never forget, like packrat. Packrat can yes. get a rokuma. They were like a tuber nekera. You call him a packrat. He never likes to be throw anything. Sometimes in our houses, there are packrats. They yes. never throw anything, right? Yes. Egulu Pudikal is calling here the Vila Vilani who put them here. Do you understand? Yes. Yes. Never throw anything. So you think it's a good thing that you never throw things, or you think it is you should throw things? No, it's a, it's not a good thing. Mm -hmm. When some when something is not useful, we need to put it to garbage. Mm -hmm. So it's not a good habit. Mm -hmm. All right, then we are going to stop. Yes.